I'm certainly riding the wave and I'm certainly proud to be one of the teachers who will, I hope, make it into the legislature. Democrat Tina Bojanowski says she decided to run before this year's massive teacher protests. I really am fighting for public education, um, really looking to repeal the charter school bill and do address the emphasis on high stakes accountability testing. She says people feel like public education is under attack by Republicans, but Republican Phil Moffitt says the GOP controlled legislature approved a record amount of school funding and pension funding. Well, you know, a lot of that goes back to some of the comments that Governor Bevin made, not the legislature. And I would ask voters to look at our actions and not words. Moffitt says Republican policies have helped Kentucky families. We've got one of the fastest growing economies in the Midwest. Our, our income, our personal income levels are growing faster than all of the states that are around us. And uh, we have a record amount of uh, investment coming into the state because of that. And those are all good things and we need to build on it. Moffitt says it's important to maintain a Republican majority to pass comprehensive tax reform, which could include eliminating the personal income tax. And what you do is you broaden the tax base and I would tax all products and all, all services, and, and that broadens the base a lot, but then you can lower the rate and actually bring more revenue in. Bojanowski would prefer legalizing casino gambling and medical marijuana and closing corporate tax loopholes. What his approach is going to do is going to put more of the burden on me, the working people, and less of a burden on the top 1%. And I think that there is a significant disparity in how much of our tax is paid by the working people, and I think it needs to be equitable. Bojanowski has never run for public office. Moffitt was first elected in 2014 and ran unopposed in 2016. Mark Vanderoff, WLKY News. Thanks.